I was pulling out my tent stuff and my hammock to make sure everything was together and everything, I had all the pieces I needed. And I was like, man, this tent rain fly looks perfect for a hammock. almost the right size so I put my hammock up and I put the rain fly on top of it and it fits almost perfectly it's a little short but it's perfect for lounging on the beach and keeping the sun off of you or like you know if you're somewhere where it's hot and you want the sun beating down on you you can put this little rain fly up and it'll sure enough keep the sun off of you it might not keep you dry but it'll keep the sun off of you so here's the setup that I grabbed all right so I got my hammock set up. You know, I know it's not set up correctly. This is just for show. And I grabbed this rain fly. See, it's just a Coleman rain fly. And I just wanted to make see if it was long enough to stretch from that end of the hammock to that end of the hammock, which it does real nicely. This is a three-person Coleman tent. Kind of get from Walmart. That's the top off of it. So the four-person would probably fit perfect. But, uh, you know, like I said, it's not for torrential down downpours, but it'll keep the sun off of you for sure. And it's got these little things right here that you can hook. Let's see if you can see this. It's got these little Velcro pieces on here for going around the tent poles. And it goes around the... It goes around your center line perfectly. Check that out. Kind of keeps it a little more together, but uh, but yeah, I thought that was an awesome idea. I just feel like I'm full of awesome ideas today, and this seems like this is gonna work. I'm gonna keep it because this rolls up really small and it will fit actually in the hammock bag, whereas like my tarp that I have for this thing won't. It's like this big rolled up bag, you know. But this I can just keep if I need a little sunshade. Boom, got it.